we we start here. Okay. This one <laughs> this one is Kandarwa for drying rice. Okay. Yes, we dry rice. Okay. And then we pack here. Here is rice that is not Pudio. Mirud. Mirud. Here is rice that is not mirud. It looks like this. Okay. Direct from the farm okay. to the Kandarwa drying okay. to the Gunia. So that we take for. Gunia is the bag. Yes. So here, oh, this one is Wamodoni and Kuanga's property. I'm going to have a little bit of 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 Okay, it was supposed to be. So, is it for you or for other farmers too? No, this one is for all the farmers. Okay. If you check the Gunia, I'm gonna judge If you want to land it, even from Grigasa, that's why you know your property. Even from so, even from Joy, that is how you know. Huh? Hello? You see, I can't go anywhere. Okay, okay. This is how you know Yako. Okay. That's this how you know your bag. Mm -hmm. uh, this is Sam. Sam is the operator. Sam is the operator. Sam is the operator of the machine. So guys, I mean, I'm coming live from a very different place. And uh, whatever you see in front of you, these are bags which have been put there to dry up. And uh, yeah, these are bags. And the people you see around those places, that is not a meeting. These they are people working. are working. They are working. This is called Mwea Irrigation Scheme. And uh, the rice that you eat here in Kenya and other parts of Kenya, outside country, outside the Kenya, I guess we also export some rice. But mainly comes from this land you see here. Yeah. And uh, guys, I haven't even done the introduction of this video. Just the view itself caught my attention. <laughs> and um, Vula, I have someone here. Hi, everyone. What's up? Okay. Introduce me. Guys, <laughs> guys, I will introduce the guests from outside. Hi, my beautiful people. Another day, another blessing. Welcome back again to my YouTube channel. Only my Vila Nikis. It's your first time to come across my YouTube channel. My YouTube channel, guys, please consider subscribing, commenting, sharing, and um, I'm not alone. Guys, I'm coming. Just look at the view. Looks like a football field, and I have an amazing, beautiful lady here. Hi. My chauffeur. Hi. Please tell them how much am I, I'm paying you for the day. Oh my God. Are you even paying <laughs> me? You should be paying me. You should be paying me. So, guys, we're going to stop here first. Uh -huh. Before I continue introducing the vlog, oh, before he continues introducing me to his vlog. Okay. So let's just stop here. We got a lot of stuff to do here, guys, and uh, we have another another guest down uh, behind there. Okay. We just had to to stop. We stopped by, and uh, let me see myself. Am I clear? Yes, I'm clear. Okay. So what's up, everyone? My name is Wamboy Lynette. Mm. And I'm so happy mm. we finally get to link up with only Mawera. After how many postponements? Uh, There's after, such a word. <laughs> after postponing for so long, but finally we are here. We're about to drop some bomb content for you guys. Yeah, 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 Currently, yeah. to come, oh, we are in a rice field yeah. in Moya, <laughs> central Kenya. Where, where? Oh my god. Where, where? Oh my god. What's up? What's up? What's happening? <laughs> She's seeing that other dog. See, I thought like this, they should communicate in a polite manner. No. Not like. Oh, you know, Luna is aggressive. <laughs> Luna, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> guys, I you out for then you guys these are animals, 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 animals. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Guys, we're coming live from Mwea Tebere Rice Kim. That's how beautiful it is. The fields, man, it looks nice. Guys, it's, uh, it's the harvesting season. It's harvesting season. And a lot and a lot of activities are happening here. 
and uh, I'm with my friend here. She's a content creator. She's a YouTuber too. We've been planning this video for the longest time, from the month of August. She's afraid, <laughs> guys. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> She's just afraid. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Are you first of all gonna deal with Luna or are you gonna introduce Let's yourself now? Luna. Let's me deal with Luna because I can't leave Palek, please. Oh yeah. Oh my beautiful dog! Let's go for a walk. Nazaka eco gari. Eh, eco gari. Eh? Eco gari. Eh? By the way, when you learn how to have a happy mother, come out it's there very far. Let me just zoom it for you. I don't know if you can see it. This one here. Focus. Mayona. Yeah, somewhere here. Yeah, so guys, I'm sorry for introducing the vlog in that manner, but we here. We tend to make use of every chance that we have, man. We've been planning this video for the longest time, from August until today. And uh, I'm running away from the music. And uh, do you hear, man? I just want to say I'm happy, happy, and welcome back again to my YouTube channel. In case it's your first time to come across my YouTube channel, please consider subscribing, commenting, liking, and sharing the video. Share, share, share. Tell people about my, your boy, man. Only my here. I'm coming live from Africa. This. Kenya and Kenya is in, in Africa and to be more precise it is in East Africa and I'm not alone today I'm with my friend here she's also a youtuber and she has her friend here but oh her friend God. is very aggressive no this dog is coming for us no no no, no you... he's peaceful he's... no Luna stop <laughs> <laughs> Hi, what's up everyone? My name is Wombo Lynette. I'm a Kenyan-based YouTuber doing travel and lifestyle vlogs. Mm -hmm. So in today's video, mm -hmm. I am in the honor of um, <laughs> Only Mawira. We are in his YouTube channel and we will be doing a very good video of how rice is produced in Moya. Central Kenya. Yeah, Moya. Central Kenya, yeah. Yeah, and uh, this is basically a rice field. So I'll just be showing him around with the help of other few people. Okay. So guys, stay tuned and watch the end of this video. So we haven't even told them your channel name and stuff like that. So my channel name is just Wamboli. That you're going to insert a description. Yeah, yeah. And tag yeah. me on your page. description on the page. I'm gonna do that. Yes, exactly. So. Yeah, we are gonna interact, and you guys remember to subscribe. But I saw something at uh, the back of your t-shirt. Oh, this is Wombo. Um, a <laughs> Liverpool Foot Club uh, mm -hmm. fan. Mm -hmm. <laughs> guys, football club, but you foot club, football club fan. Guys, I am Manchester, and I'm forever gonna be Manchester, no matter how long we're gonna be beaten. I'm still gonna remain Manchester. And please introduce your beautiful, beautiful. Dog. So I didn't want to call it a dog it's actually. A, it's, it's a dog. <laughs> so yeah. this is Luna uh -huh. and she's outside for uh -huh. the first time. Whoa, the for the first time? Yeah, she's outside for the first time. I've never taken her for like a very long walk. Okay. So today is gonna be a bit fun for her and I know she's a bit nervous and yeah. anxious. Can I touch her? Yeah, or I she's gonna bite her. me? Just yeah. Just be gentle. Yeah, be gentle. Hi, how do you feel? Do you have a YouTube channel? <laughs> do you have a YouTube channel? If you want to check her out, <laughs> remember to follow me on all socials at Wambolinet. Wow, guys, she's beautiful, 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 beautiful. All right, guys. So today this is gonna be the task. We're gonna be learning about rice. 
And uh, one thing I'm going to tell you one, uh, about this place uh, where, where we are in a uh, county called Kenya County, but not here in, in Moya. Moya is one of the leading uh, producers of rice in Kenya that we eat. 80% uh, of rice comes from this spot. And if you want to be successful in Kenya, involve yourself in three places. First one is Moya Tebere. Second one is Gikomba. Gikomba is a second selling, uh, second hand selling uh, market, and it was one of the biggest second hand selling uh, spot in Africa. Yeah, it's one of the, among the best. And the third place that you, you wanna get rich in Kenya, involve yourself with a place called Isili. Isili they sell a lot of clothes. That tells like the rotation of money is at high rate. This this uh, field that like you can see here, and this town, Moya, Moya town is not a big town, but it has a big name and it is a 24-hour economy. And like my town, which is Embu, which is just a big town, but it's not a 24-hour economy, man. So that tells, a lot, tells a lot, you a lot. One thing that you should know about the... Another thing that you should know about uh, rice, about this place, is just like uh, the fields, they have to be filled with plenty of water. Just listen to the sounds, actually. Wow, just listen to the sounds. So breathtaking. And uh, today I'm gonna be teaching you about some stuff here. Do you know this plant? Which which one? This one here. The one with broad leaves. Yeah. I have seen it, but I'm not sure of its name. Okay. So what is Do you know the product that you use for your hair? The oil is coming from that plant. Which product? What plant? This is this? this plant is called the castor oil plant. Oh my goodness! That is castor. Yeah. You didn't know now you know. I didn't know now I know. <laughs> Guys, you have some other plants here. It's called Touch Me I Sleep. <laughs> Hutia Gome. Uh, uh, from, from, from where I come from, <laughs> we used to... Can I translate it to direct English? Sure, sure, sure. To sure. the nearest English. Yeah. So, it's Wanjiro... Hutia. Mm-mm. It's called Wanjiro Moekwithia. Like... When you touch me, I die. Yeah, touch wow. me, I die. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, this is the rice field. This mm -hmm. is ready for harvest. Yeah. And if you can see, some have already harvested. Yeah. And are now cutting off the. The shaft. The the the, the grass. The the the, the husk. The These are the husk. The, are no, the husk. husk no, the husk is what you get after milling the rice. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So some have harvested, some have not harvested. Mm -hmm. And those that are doing that, it's, it's like they are, man, they are, they are thrashing, it's called thrashing. They are thrashing. At least I, I, I learned a little English somewhere. They are thrashing it manually. Yeah. Is thrashing nini? Thrashing. What is thrashing? Removing from the main plant. Yeah, thrashing, that we call uh, thrashing. I, I, thrashing is for me. Both, now it can apply anywhere. <laughs> anyway, my people gonna understand. Guys, they are beating it from the main plant now to... <laughs> yeah, to get the grain. Guys, English is not closer. water. Mm -hmm. We can move closer. Okay. So normally, mm -hmm. when, when the rice is still green, mm -hmm. there is a lot of water. You cannot walk inside the way they are there. Okay. It's usually very soggy. You know clay soil, when it gets water, it's like soggy. Yeah, you can yeah. even sink in. Yeah. So these canals mm -hmm. is where the water... Are diverted to. Yeah. Okay. And because they need the water, we have a dam over here. Yeah. We're gonna go up there. Mm. Okay. So that's where the water, the water comes from. So they always have a way to channel, like canals to channel the water in or out of the fields. Mm -hmm. In a certain for a certain period. Yeah, in, depending on the season, mm -hmm. depending if it's um, planting season, mm -hmm. um, harvesting season, mm -hmm. all that. Okay. So some mm -hmm. before the the manual threshing, mm -hmm. there are other there are other people that tend to. Use tractors. Use harvesters. harvesters. Yeah. A while back, people used to use sickles. I'm not mm -hmm. sure if you. I know. I know. I know. I know a sickle. I know how it I looks. It, it is one that did me this. So really? Yeah. It's the what sickle. were you doing? I was uh, cutting some grass. Yeah, that is what they are, they were using to mm -hmm. to like harvest mm -hmm. it all. Mm -hmm. But now it's easier because of the harvesters. Yeah. I don't know. They are called combined harvesters or something. Yeah, they don't touch uh, that harvest uh, wheat. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. But they, they are in the same family. 
yeah. basically the same wheat rice same family yeah. same growing conditions apart yeah. from the only thing about wheat that is different from rice water. is that wheat does not need a lot of water yeah, but rice requires a lot of water have yeah. you done anini uh have you done a video on wheat no 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 it yet you should you know i i, I visit timao uh -huh. Um tomorrow. Do you know a, a place where there's wheat? Yeah, Narok. Me studied in Narok in campus. Wow, so you're gonna take me some day there. Yeah, I could take you if you want. We will, we will. Right, Runa? <laughs> but we're not gonna go with you because <laughs> yeah, so guys, I'm gonna be having some chat with the with Linet as, as at the same time as we should have video. Please watch this video, comment and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And guys, go to her YouTube channel. To my channel. <laughs> go subscribe to her YouTube channel to this beautiful Rasta baby here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so come, let me show you the dam. Guys, there's a language being spoken here by the ladies from this area and it's like a Kikuyu, but not Kikuyu. Okay guys, so like in Kenya we have okay, in Kenya we have some different communities, like, like uh, about 42 communities. But the largest one is Bantu. Mana, the language that they speak, like there's Kikuyu, there's Meru, there's Kamba, there's um the people from Kirinyanga here. Now their Kikuyu is always kinda different and very funny. So sometimes when you're speaking, when they're speaking, you feel like it sounds just very, very funny actually. And uh, <laughs> sometimes it's very crazy, like uh, as someone is describing something, but you're not gonna understand it uh, because the way they say it, man, it just comes out so funny, you know. And the uh, guys are coming live from this spot here, from this uh, rice field here in, in Moya, and I'm with my friend there. Her name is Wambo Linette. She has a YouTube channel. Please go there, subscribe to her YouTube channel. We've been planning for this shoot for the longest time. And uh, the moment that she knew like I was around, man, we had to link up and do something, you know. And I'm thankful to God that I've been doing this. And uh, that's how she was telling me like this. A way that these people do control the waters, okay? This is a water gate. This is a water gate. So these things is always dropped like this. In case they want to water to stop from flowing, they drop this one. And then the water just been floating around this place. And then we have this rice here. This is how the rice looks like, man. These are rice. That's how it looks like. These are rice now. The rice that you eat on your table. When you come here when it is a when it's at the moment they are harvesting. When you come here when it is not a harvesting season, these fields are always super super green extremely green and man they always have a very beautiful view some very beautiful views so i'm gonna be joining ambolinette there up there we see what she has for us man she just want to show us a, a dump there then we chill chill and talk and do some videos with her then over there you see like they also plant some veggies those are pig weeds and some kills up over there and there's this the big gate here now these water canals, they get the water from one of the biggest rivers, it's called the river Diva. And uh, it's one of the biggest rivers around this uh, county. So this is how they receive water. These gates are for controlling water. Okay. Those are the sounds of the river. So this is how they control water. They drop this thing. I don't know how, okay, this one is tied up. So it just drops when they want order to go in or go out wow guys these are stories from africa there's africa there she is so like uh like you know um Okay, you are an indoor person, uh -huh. but you know, for YouTube, it's all, it's all about entertainment. Uh -huh. But at the end of the day, you want something from it, right? Yeah. You love to have, to have some good money. Mm -hmm. I can tell you one thing for free: YouTube has money. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, Marisa. YouTube has money, even though I haven't eaten much money from it. I haven't eaten much money. Okay, I'm almost receiving my. Okay, this one I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you off camera. Uh -huh. But YouTube has. It's a good space. Uh -huh. 
It's just, a space where you can grow. You have, you, like, you'll meet amazing people. Mm -hmm. At the same time, you're gonna meet some crazy people. Mm -hmm. So what you're gonna do is just pray to God to, to bring the right people in your life mm -hmm. or in the YouTube space. But one thing I can tell you for free, mm -hmm. YouTube is fun. Yeah. Just freedom in it. Mm -hmm. Like yesterday, I was shooting a video and I was on a motorbike and I was just screaming out of my I was screaming my lungs out and I was like if I was in an office would I have done that, such kind of a thing of course not. no yeah but YouTube has freedom mm -hmm. so I can tell you like a, like every day is a content everything is a content it only depends with what you want to give out there yeah as for you what do you want kind of content that you want to give out to people I want to travel man. you want to travel yeah. that is content mama Every day wake up like you have a destination to hit. You have to hit the road every day. I'll give you an example. Mm -hmm. uh, the person who inspired me, his name is Aya Marwa, mm -hmm. and his sister died the Mwango. Mm -hmm. right, right now, she's in Jamaica, right? Yep. She's doing, living her life. Yep. You come from where? Do you know how much this place is, has so much content you can show? You can show people how women here ride bikes and motorbikes. It's, it's lifestyle. It's nothing. It's, it's not <laughs> awkward. Stop laughing. Another thing. It's still awkward for me to be honest. And then another thing, the way people are farming, this farming, the farming of, many people do it trees, but they don't know how it's grown, right? Mm. They don't know like it has to go and go a nursery bed, then it's, yeah, it is planted, transplanted. transplanted, then a, a lot and a lot, that's a, a content. Yeah. Like every day, every day, and the more, the more you do, the more idea will always be coming. Like right now, even, even when I was starting, I didn't know what I'm going to do. Exactly, now that's the space I am in right now. Every day, the more you do this thing, the more you're gonna be executing the videos, like like the more you're gonna have the ideas of what you're gonna do. Exactly. Yeah. So so we are shooting each other. Yeah, we are <laughs> shooting each other. <laughs> okay, shoot your <laughs> shot. Shoot your <laughs> shot. Let me shoot my shot. Okay. How did you end up meeting? I am Mara. Mara. Man, uh, that question you you want me to start crying here. I'm actually I'm a very emotional person, mm -hmm. but um. Come closer. Guys, you just listen to the noises. Look at those birds. <laughs> Guys, have this. these birds here, they're very beautiful, but I think they're gonna run away from me. Yeah, please do not run away. Just stay still. Then you, you run after I film you, please. And then guys, they, you see this, the way it is, is because the, the harvester was just moving in as it was harvesting. Now this is how uh, the rice is always, uh, like it, was, uh, it always has so much water in it. And uh, actually people do get in barefoot sometimes here to plant, to plant the rice and also sometimes to harvest. And also to weed it. And then, you see here with my friend, she's there with her dog. They look so good actually. <laughs> you guys look together. You look good together. <laughs> then you have this beautiful water here from these canals here. So you told me this is this clay soil or it is just loam soil? Black black cotton. And uh, it, it 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 has a very high retention of water actually. That's why it is very good for for rice. And you guys, you look, you look good together. Look good. Yeah, you look good together. <laughs> so guys, uh, this is rice being fed by the bulls and the donkeys here. So, and uh, we're gonna be going up the dam. Then you see the dam, and then uh, my friend is gonna take me somewhere. And then we're gonna still be doing do some chit chat with her because I want to know how I caught her next year. Maybe she can have a proper. This is a donkey. Like I want her to have some good plans for her YouTube channel because she's struggling like I was struggling and she has to her help, you know. Mara gave me the help for free so why can't I do the same thing for free man? Giving her some these are, these are rice, that is rice that has been harvested and been transported to the, the portion meal to be... <coughs> are you afraid of the cows? Wambo? She's afraid of the cows and she would love some cows to be brought in her home. Hey, Peter Ivy. You're not going to go? 
<laughs> this, this one is very notorious. Any one pick a gombe makanya toka damu kaze. Ah, one pick a ndika gombe bebe ya bebe. Ata ya pick a boko askiye. A pick a boko. Guys, this guy has beaten this cow so badly, man. Ah, you na pick a jing gombe kaze evil bana. Ola la jini tu kupe kama hizo. Guys, I almost fell down. There was a that cow. It's actually a bull. It is very notorious. It doesn't want to. It doesn't want to leave the road. So the guy has beaten it until it is bleeding. So can we go this way? You are afraid of the cows, and you would love some cows to be brought in your mom's house. How? They want cash money. Ah. What if like uh, let's us let's say like uh, the person who is gonna marry their tradition is like you give animals. What no, will you do? In, 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 on, on top of bringing animals, uh -huh. you will buy land to keep those. Animals. <laughs> so like, but it's upon you as a family to know what you where you're gonna keep the animals. That no, you that's... will also buy land if he really has many cows. <laughs> How many cows do you think you are worth? Ninety-nine. <laughs> <laughs> A hundred. A hundred cows. Okay. I would not want to use the word work. Okay. But uh, that's the, the, the list. The list. Yes. The bread price. You know, bread price does not end. Sure, sure. Exactly. That's where we should start. A small appreciation token. Yes. For well, your mom. Like a hundred cows. One cow is how much? At the moment, I, I don't know. You know, the, the price of the meat has gone up. So, meaning that also the price of the cow has gone up. Yeah. That's probably exactly that was <laughs> Guys, we have this beautiful dam here. I want us to go to that place where there's some noise, beautiful noise from there. Then we go. Okay. We go to the other place. Guys, your boy is gonna jump over here. I want to jump. <laughs> oh. Okay. People do get inside there. Just look at that water. Guys, the breeze from this side. Breathtaking. So, guys, one thing I should know about rice. It has some stages. First of all, it has to, to be in the nursery bed. Then after going to the nursery bed, then you prepare the field, then you transplant them when they are seedlings. And then after that, then when they come to the field, they are planted, you know, uniformly. And uh, you don't plant them scattering, you must put them, like, must be so close to each other. And then after that, they are watered, and they are also weeded, like, people do weed the rice, actually, it is always weeded. And then the water is allowed in to flow in and out and stuff like that. Then until it is... Super super grown, uh, the, uh, it is left also to dry. Then after drying up, people are harvesting right now. So after harvesting, that uh, you see like it is being transported by the bulls and the donkeys to the to the portion mill, to the rice mills actually. They are rice mills. And then after that, it is dried. Ah, oh, first of all, it has to be dried. After those big big bags, they must be dried. Then uh, rice mills. Then after that, it is milled. Then after that, it is just now. Packed, and then it is brought to your house for you to enjoy the meals, you know, the rice that you always enjoy. So, Ambo, how long does it, does it take for us to be ready from the farm, from the day that it was planted, mm. for it to be ready until it is dry? Honestly, I'm not sure about that one. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure. And you like come from four, where? Could be like from, from August to December. August, September, October, November, December. Five months? No. Yes. No. Call Wambo, call, call Wanjiro and ask her. No, we are going Me. to look for her. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Guys, we're going to go. <laughs> She's a comedian and a serious farmer. I see some, some nests here. Some of them are very big, actually. Guys, there's some nests here. This up here. Let's look at them. I want us to go to that spot. 
guys, there are some big, big nests here. For those big, big birds. It's like a... It's like a... Eagles. Eagles. The big... The big nest is for... Yeah. The big nest is for the... For the eagles, man. And it has... It has some big entrance. Come and see the entrance. Very big. Could you want it? So those people have come for picnic. No. People are coming for picnic. Yeah. Okay. Oh my Just look at the entrance. It is super super big. Wow. This is like a whole inside. <laughs> that house is like six bedroom. <laughs> six bedroom <laughs> nest. Hello. Hey. Guys, just look at this. Look at the entrance. Very big. Wow. So around here. Okay. There is where I was carrying on like doing the cooking. It's a good bread. spot. Yeah, and I wish I was around. I could have come to eat. Yeah. Not to cook, to eat. To eat. Yeah. Do you know how to cook, Wambo? Do you know how to cook? <laughs> and I have this other here. This one is a bed seater. <laughs> this is a studio. <laughs> a studio nest. Guys, just look at this big, big nest here. They are also YouTubers. They are also YouTubers. Are they YouTubers? Our no. family members? Like how? Family, family, how? She has never told you she has a boyfriend. No, 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 no. I am her boyfriend. <laughs> Guys, she has never told her like. Uh, I Hi guys. So guys, Papa, for me, for romantic. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm sorry for putting on camera, but I saw you holding a. Stop. Only? My Marwa. Only Marwa. I saw her holding this stick and I was like, maybe she's a YouTuber too. No. I know not this one. Gen Z, Gen Alpha. You have come for TikTok. Oh, you're not it. I'm sorry. You. <laughs> Guys, did you see like where? In the Meruko Mchana during the daylight. Guys, I was jumped. Anyway, it's just. Hello guys, don't take us, it's just having fun here. Man, I want to, I, the noise from this river, very, very therapeutic. Guys, these are not arrowroot, they are just flowers, wild flowers. This is the water that is making lots of noise here. <laughs> guys, guys, we are shooting here, man. We have to take every single de details that we see. Every single detail. Every single detail. Guys, just look at it. And then it's going down the dam. I'm not the kids are swimming down there. This dam has fish. That's what I was told by my friend there. She told me like uh, this uh, has some uh, some fish. People do come here to fish. Guys, there are kids who are swimming here. 
I want my friend here to, to record me. I, I want to try and act as if I'm taking away their clothes and see how they're gonna react. <laughs> I'm gonna uh, act as if I'm taking away their clothes. Oh <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> You are such a bad person. That's a very bad prank. I know they're not even worried. In a Gen Z. <laughs> Guys, these kids are not even worried about their clothes. They don't even care. <laughs> they don't even care. No, they just wanna wear them and go. Guys, we still here with Renette and uh, my dog, Luna. Your mind from today. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. If I happen to buy a dog now, this, uh, this is going to be the, the lifestyle. Yes. <laughs> how do you look, guys? Tell us, how do you look? You look good together. I love the contrast. <laughs> white and black. White and black. So you're going to feel like this is the dog. Let the person here keep on going. Let the person here keep on going. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. It's a new place. And now it's super hyper. Ah ah. Luna. Sit. Sit down. Sit down. Hey, trend. Guys, here we have some hay. I just want to so, record that. So, when the rice dries up okay. and it's harvested, okay. what is left yes. makes hay. And now that is the food. Food for the animals, animal feed. And also seeds for those who love paring. Yeah. Now, and the person who is seeing this, this person doesn't even know her, doesn't even do the content from her own place. Why are you putting me on the spot, Marwa? I'm not Marwa. <laughs> Guys, Why? this is another, I guess, the sixth time that I'm collecting. Mawira. Marwa, Mawira. Marwa, Mawira. Marwa, like, Mawira. do you know, like, I, I, had, a, I had a name, like, a, only, I, like, I was, I am Mawira, mm -hmm. and I was like, people gonna be saying, like, I was trying to copy Marwa, you know. Really, by the way? So I had to put two for an I, I think that's why I'm, I'm calling. But it's okay. I appreciate. I am Mawira. Give Guys, me your English name. Eric. That's Eric. Mm. So, so mm -hmm. these are bags, rice bags. Eh? This man is washing his office. Yeah. Hi, Luna. Hi. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy the view, enjoy the noises from the water, man. So, so super cool, man. So, we're gonna leave this spot, go to another spot that I wanna show you. Guys, this is a donkey, they're fetching water. Guys, this is a Hey grass, we're gonna be making the hay very soon. You see those are tourists, man. Jumbo Jumbo! Your mind is still on the, uh, about the dog. <laughs> you guys have those beautiful hills there. I'm telling my friend here, even the day that she's gonna start dating, 
the boyfriend will start we will be having a struggle for the attention between the dog and the, and the guy oh, she's crying I know. The worst, the worst thing can do is to sue Peke Ake. Ah, is there a crossing spot there? Really? What are you doing? 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 What are you Sawa. Eh. So guys, we are in a dilemma. There's this river here, and uh, I wanted to shoot the harvest as it is harvesting the rice. Man, it has been crazy. We don't know the bridge that we've been to. There's a bridge. It seems to be far away from this end. What should we do, guys? That's the harvester down there. Maybe that's the name we can do at the moment. We have nothing to do apart from watch from a distance. So how deep is this river? Are you sure? Are you sure it's not deep? Don't you know how to swim? I know how to swim, but I know how to swim. You know I can get myself inside. Oh gosh. Guys. You have to watch from a distance now. YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. Where? Okay. Okay. It's like it's coming this way. Let's wait for it here. We just have a sniper, a sniper of it. I wish I can throw someone my phone. They record and they throw it back. <laughs> Guys, look at that lady riding a bicycle. This is so normal here. It's very normal actually. Very normal. Do you see how, the, how I did that? Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I see you. I'm just pretending to not see So guys, this the, the, the com... The other one was a uh, maker, this one was a... Uh, okay. Yeah. So it doesn't even have a, a stair a stair wheel, just some levers. I got some coin. I feel like I'm about to put some on the record here, guys. That is rice being harvested now, and see the man there with the bags. Same as wheat. And then the tractor is just there waiting to be loaded. Okay, we go now. Guys, that's uh, rice being dried up there. That is rice being dried up. Okay. That is uh, rice. That is rice still. That is rice and those bags, big bags there. Guys, this is the donkey droppings. 
Now this one I had eaten even a paper. <laughs> That's how they look like. And once you step them, your feet is gonna be having some funny funny looks. It's like for for zebra and also a, 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 an elephant. Yeah. I stepped on them when I was very young, actually. Bougainvillea. Really? Yeah. Bougainvillea yeah. flower. And there's, there's, there are different types. There's the white, pink, purple. purple. Orange. Yeah, they are very different. They are very, it's like roses. Yeah. So they are, some are white, pink, purple. There is yellow. There is an orange that always that looks like almost looks like yellow. Yeah. Yeah. Your village is very actually green. <laughs> yeah. You guys are like there are some villages, man. Even your mesa is bigger than ours. Sorry. Your mesa is yeah, it's very bigger than ours. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So how are you feeling today? <laughs> I'm feeling great. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what do you know about this plant here? What do you call it in your in your mother tongue? Haria. <laughs> and in the scientific name? Uh, I can't remember. Euphobia. Euphobia. It is very dangerous. The milk that the milk the milk that comes from this plant is very dangerous. If it gets in your eyes. eyes, yeah. If it gets in your eyes, a mom's like I had like only the milk from the goat, or your mom <laughs> should put some milk inside your eyes. Breastfeeding milk. Yeah, breastfeeding milk. Why are you not happy about to see these dogs? These are not my <laughs> oh, you don't you don't like wild dogs. These, these ones can be dangerous. Okay. No, mine is but, vaccinated. But they are independent dogs. Yes, they are wild dogs. <laughs> Give yourself the shout out at least. Maybe someone is joining the premier gang. Oh yes. So you usually do premiers. Yeah. So this is Wambo over here. Linnet. Check me out on YouTube at Wambo Linet on Instagram at Wambo underscore Linet. I'm a content creator based in Kenya. And, uh, but very soon you're gonna be doing village, village content. Yes. Yeah, you stop being an indoor person. <laughs> I'm gonna stop being an indoor person. Yeah. Guys, uh, we are with Wambo here. Uh, we're going to one of our other friends. She's gonna show us how rice is milled. Yeah, right. How good is that to have friends who do, who knows things or who does this kind of business? And courtesy of Wambo, actually. Courtesy of you. Courtesy of Wambo. <laughs> there's a there's a song that do you know that song like Wambo is it you are kwani kyoko you know what I mean? It's since I have that song, but, but I know. But you know it. <laughs> I know it. Chadore udire ba shawe okadi ganeri. Ah, was always a boy. A boy we do a besha oshoti wo we do. Menyare u we do ama umana gana goro we do. Do you know that song? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, it's a sunflower. sunflower. Yeah. Oh my God. So what do you know about sunflower? Uh -huh. Mostly for animals. Okay. That's what I know. Okay. You can make it like animal feed for your goats mm -hmm. and chickens and what. Mm -hmm. And also, if your land is full of sunflowers, mm -hmm. it's a very nice place to go mm -hmm. and have a photo shoot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sunflowers is not only for animals. Guys, just look at the way these people they were weeding. They had to put so much soil on the maize. Uh, that we think like the moment the more you put the soil near the maize, the more nutritious it's gonna get. Of which I highly doubt. I highly doubt that one. So sunflower is also a snack for people. People do take it as a snack. Sunflower. Yeah. Uh -huh. It is taken as a snack. Uh -huh. Another thing, uh -huh. the sunflower follows the sun. Yeah, it always follows the sun no, direction. No. I. Like, Once, oh, the weight is usually bent like this. Yeah, like it will always, it is always, really? it's always gonna fall the sun. No, you're lying. No, I'm not so lying. So it usually like goes round yeah. during the day. Yeah, yeah. So in like in 24 hours, yeah. it will have gone like yeah, yeah. the whole just clockwise. Go, just be observant with it. 
No, I'll have to Google that. Okay. I'll have to Google that. Okay. What? And especially the sunrise. And especially the sun, the sun, where the sun rises from. Uh -huh. It's gonna be facing that. These, these are. These are beans. The these beans are and, uh, beans. and millet. And Is it millet? No, uh, sorghum. Sorghum. So why are they collecting these bottles? For playing? Na pela ka bichupa mingi. Zakfani. Hmm. Na ucheza na zo. They are for playing. Guys, we see we have Harvard in Kenya. Harvard. <laughs> Harvard University has a branch in Kenya. There's a gas station here, man. Gas station. But here you call them petrol station. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing like a uh, gas station in, here in Kenya. It's just petrol station. Mm -hmm. Guys, all those bags that you see there, those are rice bags. Those men are walking on top of those. Uh, oh, yeah. On top of sip. Top of a bag. So guys, uh, my friend here, this is where she works in uh, their factory at the rice mirrors and it's called Baraka. Baraka rice mirrors and stores here in Moya, in Kenya County. And we're going to be going in, she's going to be showing us how rice is prepared, how it is milled and how it is even packed. And then everything else that happens after that, now you can see that she's selling, is a package for somebody. So guys, you can see she just made a sale. Now that place is going to someone's table. So guys, this is the store and that we're gonna be doing there, and we're gonna be seeing whatever happens inside there. So please keep on watching this video, subscribing if you haven't subscribed. Please comment. Let me know what you think about the video. I feel like your boy is gonna enlighten you. Your boy is gonna entertain you. Okay. You can see everybody here is super super busy, super super busy, and they sell pure pishu. Actually, I can feel the scent. Like pure pishu rice has a has a smell, a sweet scent. So I can feel the scent of the pishu actually. So that's gonna be awesome. Let's enjoy the video. Please remember to subscribe, to comment, 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 share, 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 share. All right, guys, let's go. Guys, we're in Club Mamuda. See how people are feeling the rice. So guys, that's how they are fearing this rice. Niula. I don't know if it's Niula. Guys, our friend is here. <laughs> just look at us. He's just kind of dancing, dancing. Hi <laughs> guys. <laughs> guys, just she's not mad. She's super normal. <laughs> YouTube channel. <laughs> 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 you guys, we're gonna receive this hug together. <laughs> you are becoming Tora and Tora. She's always on a high vibe, man. <laughs> mm? Welcome, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, guys. <laughs> Welcome, guys. <laughs> Welcome, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, she's talking in a, in a vernacular language. So here you have to talk English. English? <laughs> yes, I don't. I'm not Kenyan, you know. Oh, I come. Yeah. I come from Nigeria now. Nigeria. Yeah. Hello, this, eh? this is my friend from Kenya. Kenya. Yeah. Here is where we sell. This is the store now. Okay. The, we we start here. Okay. This one. <laughs> this one is Kandarwa for drying rice. Okay. Yes, we dry rice okay. and then we pack here. Here is rice that is not Udeo. Mirud. Mirud. Here is rice that is not mirud. It looks like this. Okay. Direct from the farm okay. to the Kandarwa drying okay. to the Gunia. So that we take for. Gunia is the bag. Yes. So here, oh, this one is Wamodoni and Kuanga's property. <laughs> 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 
Nous avons dit que 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 Okay, it was supposed to be. So is it for you or for other farmers too? No, this one is for all the farmers. Eh? Okay. If you check the Gumiya, I'm trying to do a deal. If you know that you land it quick, even from Grigasa. That's why you know your property. Even from so, even from Joy. That is how you know. Huh? Hello? You live here in Ghana, Boleni. You live in Ghana. That means you land it quick more time. Okay. okay. FWN. This is how you know Yako. Okay. That's this how you know your bag. Mm. Oh, this is some some new operator. Some said you have to put the This is the operator of the machine. Guys, she's she's just some another vibe. No, no, no. No. Okay. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> Let us continue. When I move, we move. <laughs> Now this is why you come to the millers, eh? Okay. So guys, inside the rice millers, eh? So guys, this is the meal. Uh, this one is ready to be eaten, ready to be on your table. Yeah. Ready for you for your Christmas. Now, you know, now we are done. Okay. Here is the CEO of Baraka Rice Millers. All right. His name, yes, you know him. Yeah. The way you are smiling, I can see you. Do. <laughs> Hello. So His you know each other. Yeah. Okay. He does not know me though. Oh, okay. this is one boy, yeah. and this is Bison. Yeah. One boy is a YouTuber. This is a, 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 a musician. <laughs> I I, I'm, a, I'm a musician too and a YouTuber, YouTuber. too. Yeah. Oh wow! Yes, yeah, cool. that, and um, we're you gonna talk behind the genre? camera. What genre? Uh, I sing gospel ah. and love songs and <laughs> just good music. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> but I also now, now I'm, 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 but I'm, I'm serious, so serious into YouTube. Mm. Very serious. Very serious. Ah. Very serious. Oh, very serious. Oh, so you, you I'll tell you. Okay. Only my way round. Ah, okay. Only Mawera. Mawera. Only. 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 Uku, when uh, you you come here uh, as a farmer, uh, ulipishan we stock ya kwa kampeni. You don't pay for the stock yes, for the storage. Yes, but you have to mill here. Okay. So we have a go down down there. Okay. Yes. Ule oh. jenga go down ingi no kuchini. All right. Ule jenga kampeni. All right. So basically, this is where the magic happens. Kuna mna uzwa kila kitu. Okay. You come, na choose ni unataka. Okay. Yeah. 
So I, I, I give a client, I give you a client. Did she call you? Mm -mm. She hasn't called you. Mm -mm. I'm gonna call her. I Please have a call her to call me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, because my name is Wanjiro Pishori. I sell pure Pishori. Come and show you. Pure, pure, pure Pishori rice, guys. These things are happening from Africa, from Kenya, from Moya. Moya in Kenya County. And guys, there's a big man behind Baraka Nice Mirrors. We're gonna talk business later. No problem. <laughs> Alright, guys. Mambo! Abuju Buju! Abuju Buju! ma! Guys, when you're here, you just have, you must have some good vibes. You told me you are serious. Guys, now this is the yes. pure bishori rice. Yes. How do you, do you differentiate between the pure bishori rice and the other, which has uh, some some spray? So how we differentiate? Mm -hmm. First of all, mm -hmm. uh, first of all, Mono, shoot. allocate yourself with the millers that doesn't mill any other type of rice. Okay. For example, in these millers we don't sell atukwangi na mchelingine tunasiaga bishori peke Pure bishori rice. Let me tell you, mm. Mm. Now this is what happens. Eh? Okay. For example, whatever rice we are selling right now mm -hmm. is a, is the rice that we harvested already. Okay. Okay? okay. So what you do, uh -huh. the trick is how you dry it. Okay. Uki dry shakidogo and then you mill, mm. but the rice will be wet. Mm. Oh, okay. mm. Yeah. But when you you kausha so when many times, it, so... inakuwa dry. Then every time somebody tells me, me I'm telling you, kinunua mo inakuwa ni mchanganyo. Na mo ambianga try a wanjiro pishori. Try wanjiro pishori. You never say that again. Okay. So yes, and it is poor pishori. And I will tell you, go to my account, TikTok. I got your comment from mm here. -hmm. Try my. Yes. Sit at the table But on my behalf, yes. Me on my behalf, I can even stand here. I can stand on top of this rice and tell everybody. Now, Galasha kina mutu ana kuranga pua pishori. Try my pua pishori before you tell everybody. Oh, moya wana mix mutere. Dari pia wanjiro pishori. Uta yambi amutu mingine. Okay. Alright, guys. Her name is Wanjiro Motima. She sells some rice. She's a comedian. She's a woman with good vibes, and then uh, she's uh, just a good spirited person. And she has a TikTok account. You also have a YouTube channel, right? Yes. Please, tell, please. Please, yes, uh, please, I want you to be serious for once. Tell people your page, they're gonna follow you. I promise you. I have a very faithful audience. They're gonna follow you up, please. Guys, this is how you see. Uh, please, again, I missed that one. I want to show you how, the, uh, how it is. Uh, I just had some sound here. I want to see him. So that is how it feels, yeah? For the sake of security purposes. Okay. And get into the client when it's safe, okay. just be sealed with that machine. Okay. Mm. At the time when you keep your machine, when it's sealed, eh, yeah. how to unseal it, it will give you hard time, by the way. Right. Yeah. So, and how, like, uh, mm -hmm. how do you brand your rice here? Like, because I, there are so what many. We, do, uh -huh. we don't brand, uh -huh. okay? You just come here as an individual, as a farmer, okay. you sell to someone. Eh? Okay. So your client will know you okay. depending on how you call yourself. For example, myself, I call myself Wanjiro Wapishori. Okay. Okay? okay. So that is what you brand yourself. Eh? Uh -huh. We avoid that branding so much because imagine a lot of brands in this place. Okay, try to cut it short. Are you feeling this one? Yes. So, sorry. Sorry, not sorry for a minute. He's feeling the bug. Very easy, nice and easy. Very easy, nice and easy. Yes. Back so to you now. So when it's sealed like that, okay. it will be safe to, until she gets to the cloud. So you was we were saying about branding. Okay. Why you don't brand yourself? So the reason why we don't brand ourselves. Okay. Already these are millers. Okay. It has given you somewhere you can sell uh -huh. your rice. 
yeah. and you are not paying anything. Okay. You get it, eh? Yeah. The only thing you pay for yeah. is when you meal, you pay for the services. Oh, only. only. So imagine this is a brand by itself, okay. as a meal, and then you come yourself with another brand. You say it's not yes, making yes, sense. Yes, it's not gonna so make sense. So if somebody wants to brand themselves, maybe Wanjiro Pishori, you want to brand there, I'll have to go and take my shop, rent, yeah. and then. I, uh, it as I get it. But from here, my customer knows me as Wanjiro Pishori. Yeah. So the other thing, eh? Yeah? Yeah. You told me to be serious. Yeah, be serious. serious. Here I come. So, hi guys, my name is Wanjiro Wapishori. You can call me Mary Wanjiro Mwangi. That is my Mpesa name. Uh, I sell Wapishori from Kirinyaga County, Mwea. Okay. I am a farmer. I am a rice uh, rice farmer. Mm -hmm. I was a rice seller, sorry. Mm -hmm. Uh, what else do I do? Oh, yeah, comedian. It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> yes, uh, I'm an actress, I'm an entertainer. Yes, but uh, I call myself an entertainer <laughs> because I do more than just being a comedian. <laughs> yeah, let's continue. So, I'm an entertainer from Kirinyaga County. Okay. Call me a business lady. So, any rice products that you want, from, may it be white rice, brown rice, uh, husk. I'll show you husk when you're going out. Mm -hmm. Bran. Hey, hey, Nila Kuluwa na Ngombe. Yeah, I'm done for her. Those one I deal with all of them. Okay. So I give my number. Do this. Uh, my audience, my audience is from, I'm, I'm half audience from international. So give it plus 254. Okay, okay, okay. So my, oh, thank you. So my phone number is plus 254 okay. 7230818560. Again, please. Plus 254. Hallelujah. Plus two five four okay. seven two three zero eight one eight five six. Okay. Call me by that number. Text me via WhatsApp. Okay. And I will deliver to you. So another another thing that uh, maybe I have audience from outside. Maybe they would love to send some gifts to, to people. Mm -hmm. Uh, maybe there, some of them are Kenyans living in the, in the US, in UK. They would love some to send some uh, rice to their families. Mm -hmm. Do you do those kind of services, please? Yes, yes okay. I do. Uh, from my TikTok account, mm -hmm. uh, you get I deal with a lot of people. Okay. But then most of them they are outside country, yeah. so they send me. Okay. They order and then they send the money, yeah. then they send the details, okay. so that I can communicate to the people who are in Kenya, okay. so I can deliver to them. So okay. I do all those services. Okay. I don't have limitation at okay. because you are outside or something. Okay. Even if you are outside and you want to surprise someone in Kenya, in Uganda, in Tanzania, yeah. I do deliver this. Okay. Guys, please surprise me with 10 bags of rice. <laughs> yeah. I'll be happy to eat a very huge Christmas. But anyway, guys, her name is Mary uh, Wanjiro Motma, as you can see here by her name, please. Sure. Go to her YouTube channel, please. Uh, your YouTube name? My YouTube, is, is, my YouTube name is Wanjiro Motma. Okay. Uh, Facebook is Wanjiro Motma. Okay. Motma is spelled as M O R T I M E R. Mm -hmm. But on my talk, TikTok is Wanjiro Pishon. Okay. Yes. We're gonna go, go outside because of the music copyright here. We don't want to know about it. We are a serious business, so. Let me show you the husk. Okay, guys. You guys, is this happening in Kenya, in Africa? Yes, we are in Africa. Yeah. So, uh, rice has. Um, they have got what? Product? Raw material. Raw material. Yeah. Husk. Husk is what? By product. By product, yeah? Okay. Like husk. This is. From, from the, the rice I shown you before it was milled, you saw these these kind tokonis, tokonis. Okay, these yes. are the rice covers. Yes, the rice covers. Okay. So after we have milled, okay. we have the the covers. Uh, okay. Yes. So we sell the covers. They are called husk. This is what is called husk. So uh, they are used uh, as human feed. Uh, I mean animal feed then. No, 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 no. Uh. They are not for animal feed. They are, uh, they are for. They are not so for what animals. happens? Okay. You know, I told him they are for animals. Yes, they are for animals, but not to intake not to eat okay what? like it as, as um mm. what do you so you spread inside like a cow shed yes you live so you spread for the animals and also um, chicken chicken, the chicken yes no 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 no, 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 no. when it maybe can't. maybe when when you're having maybe some you are, you are a chicken farmer and they like you just spread them so that the chicken would have some feel experience. So some it's cold. also used for, for pharmacy. You remember mulching? It was called mulching. Mulching, yeah, 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 mulching, yeah. yeah mulching. It's used for that. And then uh -huh. here to those people who the company, cement company. Okay, let's go this way yeah. because yeah, of the yeah. dust from. Yeah, the... cement company. Okay. Because when you burn it, it right. doesn't burn so fast. It will take time okay. before it burns like completely. Okay, guys, so let me my camera. Uh -huh. has, I don't know what it is for. But okay. I think it's for burning, yeah? Okay. Yeah. So far, I know that one. Okay, yeah. guys. So, me, when I was younger, I sell to people who have pigs, um, cows, chicken. Okay. 
those um, mostly those are my customers. And then I asked, I saw some there are some husks which were being burnt in the shamba. Mm. What was the purpose of that one? In the shamba? Yeah. Oh, there are some companies, uh, fertilizer companies. Eh? Okay. They are doing uh, what do you call it? Value addition or something like that? No, 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 no. I think yeah. they want to do research and see. Uh -huh. You know this this nini for mulching, uh -huh. and also when you take it to the shamba, it's it's a good manure, kinda. Okay. Uh -huh. But when you add something on it, okay. so I think those fertilizer companies they are doing some research to see whether mm -hmm. they can change from using uh, the main fertilizer and then use this. Okay. Uh, they burn it. Okay. See, they burn it something like that. Maybe All I'll right. take you some. Uh, I'll take you one day. I don't oh. know. I'll and take you. We're gonna do so. Yeah. We're gonna end the video from this angle and uh, guys. Ambo come here, we'll be the short one in the middle. Guys, come this side here, here because of the light and mm. stuff. So guys, we're gonna be ending the video from this side. Ambo, you're not focusing on the video. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> Please give yourself a nice sh the last shout out as you're ending the video. Hi, thank you for watching to this point. My name is Wambo Lynette. Follow me on my YouTube channel and all other social media platforms at Wambo underscore Lynette. Alright, you. <laughs> it's my turn. Yeah. Hi guys, so thank you so much for keeping it, it, keeping Only it. Here. <laughs> Keep it Keep. keeping it locked. One is this young XYD. No, no. Okay. No. So hi guys, thank you for keeping it with Mawera and thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe and of course to follow me on all social media platforms at Wanjiro Motma and of course on TikTok as Wanjiro Wapishori. Alright guys, so that is from me and my friends here. We're gonna be having an awesome conversation off camera. Then we're gonna buy some rice and go and eat. Please remember to subscribe, to comment, share, 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 share. Alright? See you on the next video. Adios! Bye! <laughs> oh. What a man can do, a man can do better. Oh, machine. Oh, you've won. You've won.